All this month at Appalachian Wireless, get the only truly water-resistant Android smartphone, the Samsung Galaxy S7, for just $99.99, and get a second one free. While supplies last, service agreement is required. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. After three days of searching, the body of a man who went missing in the Tug Fork River was found today. We feel sorry for the family and our condolences go down to them. At approximately 1243, the body of 46-year-old Roy Toller Jr. of Mayan, West Virginia, was found in the river along the Kentucky-West Virginia border. Search crews intensified their efforts Friday. Over two dozen people, eight boats, divers, community members, and two cadaver dogs combed through the river and riverbank to search for Toller. Officials say the cadaver dogs found the body near the spot where Toller entered the water. We've been doing this two and a half, three days hard, long hours. The weather hadn't been the best, but we got a break today. Nobody wants to be the burden of bad news, but they're glad that it's over and they got closure. That was one thing that they were really looking for. Toller went missing Wednesday evening after attempting to cross the river from one side to the other. Witnesses say he went under and never resurfaced. Officials say the past three days have been very tense for search crews. When you first start searching, everybody's in such a rush to try to find the person of interest because we don't know where or when we might find him. And the weather broke, but we had rain. And when you don't find what you're looking for, you start getting aggravated and things become a little bit more treacherous. Two others were rescued Wednesday night. Reporting in Beach Creek for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.